Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, welcome to my channel. My name is Hales, and I make videos about the books that I'm reading. So today's video is just me kind of vlogging the experience of going to the House of Flame and Shadow midnight release at Barnes & Noble. I had such a good time. It was so fun. I haven't been to a midnight release since 2008 when Breaking Dawn came out. So I didn't really know what to expect, but it was honestly so fun. I kind of wish that I had been able to go to the Iron Flame event because it was just such a good time, but it, it exceeded my expectations. I had a blast. I only took a couple of clips. I didn't really want to vlog too much. I was having fun, it was entertaining, there was a scavenger hunt, a bunch of like, there was trivia, there was a cosplay contest, it was just super fun. So I very much just wanted to be like in the moment and I was and it was great and yeah so this is the video. I am headed to the event at Barnes & Noble. This is probably an awful view, but I am on my way out. This book is so stunning. I love like the gold and then it's got little bits of gold foiling on it. And oh my gosh, it is huge. I think I have like every version of this that you can get, uh, hardcover, ebook, audiobook, and I've just been switching through all of them. So getting it done, I only finished House of Sky and Breath like three days ago. I was so tired getting home from the event last night. I was going to sit down and film this and like talk about the experience. And I had to go to bed. I was so tired. I had my music up in the car as loud as it would go, just like trying to keep myself awake. Which is funny because I typically stay up that late, but just being out and then having to drive 20 minutes home was kind of, it was kind of a lot. And I don't do that all that often, so. Yeah, but I am so excited to finish the series. Uh, they've been calling it the finale currently as of like today. I hadn't seen it like talked about as a finale, but then I got an email today and it listed like Crescent City finale as one of the like tags on it. And I thought we were gonna get at least one more book and apparently we are. Uh, Sarah J Mass said in an interview that she knows what's gonna happen next, but it's gonna be a while. So that's, you know, finale for now. Kind of sad, I don't want to say bye to these characters. It takes me so long to read these books because I just don't ever want it to be over. And I am sad that this is really gonna be over for a little while. Um, I have to put this book down. It is so heavy. I had to get up because I forgot that we got little goodie bags for being like the first hundred people into the event. Um, this was just the scavenger hunt. Uh, that was fun. Everybody was struggling <laughs> trying to find everything. Um, but okay. So we got these little magnets. I'm gonna put one on my TBR cart, uh, but it's the cover of the book and that was really cool. And I love, oh, oh, okay. And then I thought this, I th thought we got, they were all magnets, but this one is a book cover sticker. So I might stick that into the my Kindle case. That's okay. It's like, that's a little bit thinner than the other ones. Um, and then we got little stickers. I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Oh, or maybe, is it a, 
No, it's a temporary tattoo. Okay. It's a little sun temporary tattoo. That's cute. Okay. See, I looked at it all last night, but I was so tired. I had to get up at one point and just go. I was looking for the bookmark. It's in the book. Um, so I'll grab that real quick. But I had to get up at one point because I thought that I was going to fall asleep. Um, chapter. Okay. So another bookmark. Another. It's the only one I have. Um, and then in the back, on the back, it says a world in darkness, a burning spark, a blaze of stars. Uh, and it's pretty much the cover of the book as well. It's the, like the crescent moon, uh, just like super zoomed in on the face. And that's really cool as well. I like having bookmarks that match whatever book I'm reading. I just think that's super fun. Uh, I'm gonna, well, I've read farther in the ebook than I have in the physical book, so I have to catch up. So I'm not gonna put that back in yet because I don't know where I am. Uh, but yeah, that was, oh, and the, like the crescent moons are foiled, which is really cool. I looked at the, I was so tired last night. I was laying in bed and I was like, I slept three hours last night. Maybe I won't go. Um, I'm so glad that I ended up going. I had the best time. I really hope that they're going to do more of these events in the future. I feel like I would genuinely go to one of the events, even if I hadn't read the book yet. Like the, if it were in a series, if it, like for a previous book, um, just because it was so much fun. I made a friend. I made a new friend. That was awesome. Uh, yeah, it, it, it was fantastic. I, it's all I really can say about it. I had a blast and I really hope that they do more of these events. I missed midnight releases because they stopped doing like the movies and stuff. They stopped doing those at midnight and now it's like okay 6 30 let's head to the movie theater it's gonna premiere a day early at seven so yeah I've I've missed just the excitement and just being surrounded by people who are all interested in the same thing so I really I do I've, I've said it like five times but I do really hope that they keep doing these events because it was a blast and I had such a good time so that's it for this video. I know that it's not super long. I think I talked more than I showed things from the event, but I had such a great time and I want it documented on my channel. And I really hope that we get to do these events again, but that's it for this video and this event. If you liked it, like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.